A massive earthquake shakes central New Zealand. A frightened man videos the moment his apartment rattles, dishes break and pictures nearly fall off the wall. This quake was huge, measuring around 7.8. At least two people were killed. This is all that remains of a house where one of those people died. It's near the fishing village of Kaikoura, one of several remote areas hit hardest by the quake. Help <laughs> and get me out. It's, it's, yeah, it's hard. Sorry. Do you want us to? Well, it's in the Christchurch ones and uh, this just put it all back. Roads cracked and were blocked by falling rocks. Emergency crews are struggling to get through. So the slips here are horrendous, to put a uh, final point on it, and you've got to believe it's in the billions of dollars to resolve these issues. They have huge slips. The quake struck around midnight local time. It was about 23 kilometres deep. The centre was on the northeast coast of New Zealand's South Island. Thousands of people headed for higher ground after the quake triggered a small tsunami with waves around two metres high. For many, it brought back memories of six years ago when the nearby coastal city of Christchurch was devastated by a quake which killed 185 people. That measured just 6.3. This latest one was much bigger, but less deadly as well, striking away from large towns and cities. Still, for some New Zealanders, this quake hit far too close to home. Rob Matheson, Al Jazeera.